I've met so many fascinating people. I've been so fortunate. During her dazzling career as senior editor and special diplomatic correspondent for Newsweek and The Washington Post, Lolly Graham Weymouth has conducted countless interviews with world leaders and thought makers from South America to Europe, from Africa to Asia, and above all, when it comes to the Middle East, she has provided readers with the insight of foreign politics. I find it a fascinating area where there are really bright journalists, really bright politicians. It just never ceases to be interesting. I love going to other parts of the world. I find them interesting too. I like going to Latin America, Asia. I like going everywhere. But I always find the Middle East to be the most interesting. I think the peace process has, has lost its credibility uh, in people's minds in this area. Since her early days, Mrs. Weymouth was known for her strong, elegant, and independent voice covering all sides of the conflict. What about Ahmadinejad? Ahmadinejad, more and more, is becoming a problem for the world. I've had so many memorable experiences. Prime Minister Rabin once sent me to Gaza when it was closed with the army, which was pretty memorable um, and pretty <laughs> hair-raising because um, a general took me into the one of the Jabalia, one of the refugee camps. The way she feels about Israel, the lioness in her that would fight against anyone who would try to harm Israel is unlike any other person I know. Israel is clearly a strong U.S. ally and it's important for Israel and the United States should remain uh, strong allies. And I believe that ultimately Israel can only make peace if it has a strong and secure relationship with the United States. And I think it deserves to have that relationship. <laughs>